Hallo. Hallo. Yay. Yay. Welcome back to the Moveler HQ. It is May 26th. It is Thursday. I'm here. Tesla's here. Yes. And Martin is here. He is so tired. Oh my god. He has been spending like a week every day. Like he's he's at home with me during the mornings and during the nights and evenings. But he's spending the days over at my parents' house where he is chasing squirrels all day long. And he <laughs> is so tired right now uh, because they had to run an errand. So he will be here like till lunch and then he will over to that their place but i think he's pretty content with just being here and chilling out because he needed that what happens today anna yes anna is coming here today we're gonna do her nails so that's gonna be fun i'm gonna show you that i'm full-blown editing today mm. like martin is snoring right now um i have to buy some lunch yeah we're gonna we're gonna try out a new place that just opened up like a burrito place yes Encanto. Senor, Senor Bob. Oh, get it. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Senor Bob. And I will also edit. I have two Light Elegance videos to edit. I can actually show you the sets that I did. They're over here. So this is one set that I will edit today. So it's for the summer collection. Uh, glitters and colors. And then I did this neon set for the buttercream collection so those are the two videos that i'm editing today look at martin oh my god he is sleeping like a little pig <laughs> or rock a puppy pig a puppy pig förlåt martin stör jag dig oh god if if uh, looks could kill <laughs> mm. I will die. Okay, okay. Shh. Lots of stuff happening today. Nails, doing nails, uh, editing, eating burritos. Yes. And cuddling with Martin. Of course, we're gonna watch RuPaul's Drag Race. Yes. RuPaul's Drag Race. Let's uh, get into this day. Do Yay. it. Shut up. Ooh, shut up. Din mat luktar gott. Känner hela vägen här. Ah, no, me neither. So we wanted to have lunch at that new place, but they were closed. Look at Tesso. Look at her disappointed face. Mer. Because it is Kristi Himmelfad. Oh. Mm. Oh. Well, I grabbed something from the fridge. Uh, Tessa went and got some falafel. Yes. Mm. So I am microwaving my food. And then... Oof, this light. And then we're gonna watch RuPaul's Drag Race. Yay. Maybe we should have uh, a mango. <laughs> Martin is awake. He's very tired today, but now he's awake. Hello, hello, hello. Oh, there it is, so. Let me go. Let me go, mom. Mm. Wow. Huh? Oh. He's more interested in the food right now. That is all, mom. <laughs> Come on. 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 Come Martin. Mm. Mr. Martin, mm. would you like a little bit of potato? Oh, oh. mems, 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 mems. Mm. 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 <laughs> 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 
Okay. 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 Okay.
so it is now 5.25 and it is raining like crazy right now and we're watching the uh, Amber Heard and Johnny Depp trial yes on TV live day 22 mm. I think objection hearsay <laughs> um, we have a topic to discuss I posted this reel right here boop, on my social media yesterday and it got a lot of views and I would say 99% of the people actually agreed with me this time. Yay. <laughs> I was not bashed. Woo. And we're talking about age limit um, when it comes to getting your nails done. And this was actually brought up by one of our crew members, uh, Erika. Uh, she was talking about this a couple of days ago, and then we figured that is a really good topic actually to uh, talk about and highlight. When I did nails, when I had like regular my, clients, yeah, regular clients, I had like a 16 year old age limit, but ish 18. And there are a couple of reasons for that. What's your age limit? Uh, 18 or 16 with the parents. Oh yeah. Approval. Yeah, I would say that's what I had. Uh, I would rather not do someone under 18 because then usually the parents get involved and that can be a little tricky. Yes. So this is what it says. Under 16, uh, no nails for you and this is why. <laughs> so uh, you probably think that this is super unfair but let me list five reasons why I don't do gel or acrylic nails, uh, nail extensions on people under 16. And here's the thing, I mean you can do gel polish on someone younger but I would still maybe stay away from that, from that and I have the reasons why. Uh, you can do nail polish, it's just as good, or press-ons. Press-ons are amazing. Just do press-ons. I mean, yeah. come on. Press-ons, they rule. The first reason why I don't do it is because kids, teenage hormones can cause the material to literally pop off and I as a nail tech won't be, uh, won't be able to give you any guarantees on my work. And that's just how it is. Uh, hormones uh, at that age, even when you're a kid, it is kind of like up and down, going through the roof and so on. And um, usually we give you like maybe like a one week guarantee or a couple of days or something, but we can't do that with teenagers or kids because we don't know how their body will react to having artificial nails they can actually just pop off. Number two, as a kid or a teenager, the nails are not also fully developed and are more sensitive. Uh, you also use your hands in a different way than an adult and thereby risking permanent damage on the natural nails. So um, since you are using your hands in a different way as a kid or a teenager, you're not as careful maybe, that goes for adults as well. Yes. Um, but I want kids to be able to play you know, and do stuff with their hands, they should not be restricted to long nails. Um, and since their nails are more sensitive, they're still growing. I think they're growing up until the age 16, 15 or 16. Um, so then we shouldn't really inter intervene with that, uh, I think. So you really risk getting permanent damage to your nails and you do not want to do that. Uh, number three is that children have a high risk of developing allergies because nails, it, it's, it's a type of plastic. And if you get an allergy to this plastic, it could then spread over to everything plastic. It could be that you won't able, even be able to uh, hold on to a plastic bag when you are uh, shopping for groceries. So you do not want to risk that. And since you are more sensitive as a child, why not wait until you are older? Number four, aftercare and taking care of your extensions is super important and a responsibility that you can't really expect from a child. And when I say child, I do mean both kids and teenagers. Of course, it differs from person to person. Some uh, kids or teenagers might handle it superb and uh, better than adults, but you never know and if they do not take care of their nails you will have to deal with the parent and it's like their words against yours 
and it's it's just the best it's better to just wait until you have someone that is uh mature enough to actually take care of it and take that responsibility uh, number five and this is my most important one personally kids should be kids and they should not be held back because they need to think about their nails Play and have fun. You got the rest of your life to be restricted by long nails. <laughs> and the thing is, I think it's so sad that kids are not allowed to be kids anymore. Um, they have to grow up so fast. Seriously, I would say 10 year olds uh, put on makeup better than I did when I was 28 or 29. <laughs> um, I mean, they don't really go through that awkward phase anymore. When we were kids, well, at least when I was a kid, I had those 90s eyebrows and we learned how we learned how to uh, put our makeup on through magazines and it was not pretty at all. Um, kids nowadays, they know everything about makeup and hair and style and I feel like they are forced to grow up into women or adults like so fast. They they know from when they start to think be able to think that they have to be pretty and so i feel like me just setting my foot down and saying that okay i will not do nails on you it's just my tiny little way just making sure that they kind of stay away from that world a little bit longer because i wish that for kids today and teenagers i don't know what do you think i agree you agree I agree. Yep. Slam, slam dunk. Slam, slam dunk. dunk. I agree. Yeah, definitely. Mm. Press ons. Just do press, press ons. ons. Press ons are amazing. Uh, you just put on your little glue tab, you put the nail on, and then you take it off when you need to. No risk of damaging anything. Nope. If it pops off, it pops off. So, press ons. Press ons. Mm -mm. And I mean, I would say this is the same thing goes with, you know, dyeing your hair or yeah, you know, <laughs> <laughs> getting fillers or yeah. stuff like that. I would say if you got kids or teenagers, try to convince them to wait as long as possible. Because once you get in that mud um, sewage, <laughs> then you're stuck for life. And um, yeah. I just really 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 want kids to be kids and even if you're 16 you're still a kid like you're a teenager but you're still a kid so um that's my opinion feel free to slaughter me in the comment section or not or just agree <laughs> you guys are always I would say 99% of you guys are always very supportive so thank you for that <laughs> um but that's it we're gonna work a little bit longer. We're gonna continue with the Amber Heard and Johnny Depp trial. Yes. And uh, that's, uh, yeah. And then we're gonna go home. Uh, I think it's stopped raining now, actually. So. Yay. Yay. Cool. Okay. Make sure to like, subscribe, and push that little notification bell so you don't miss out whenever we post a new video. We will see you guys in the next video. Bye bye. Mmm.